Hey, be quiet, be quiet. Come on, you bunch of wankers. This is unbearable. Shut up. Yeah. Officers Eddie Pulaski and Frank Tenpenny, both hardworking members of a community policing unit, have been charged with racketeering, corruption, narcotics, and sexual assault. They brought it on themselves. That bastard cost me my farm. And he hogged the bar. fellow officer Ralph Pendleberry, who had threatened to turn state's evidence and who was then found shot dead in a supposedly unrelated gang incident. I say 20 years. Airport. Try five years. Trial, Cops always get off easy. Yeah, I heard that. Lost evidence, retracted witness statements, and now the disappearance of fellow officer Jimmy Hernandez and officer Pulaski himself, believed to be on the run. Oh wait, they're exiting the courtroom now. That bastard Pulaski will probably the turn up listen, dead listen. just like the rest In light of them. the lack of evidence against my client, the district attorney's office has seen fit to drop all charges what? against this innocent man. That's bullshit. You see? You can't trust the system, man. This surprise decision is wholly unprecedented. Oh man, ain't no justice. It's just I know. Us. I've been arrested yeah, numerous times for totally natural be behavior. Los Santos will burn tonight. Ain't nobody what? gonna be riding in my hood. I don't know about that, Holmes. Look, the whole city is going up. Oh, People are fucking go. pissed off about <laughs> this. People don't know what they want. We all being you. You see, man, it's always the same, friend. Power systems corrupt everyone. Look, I said we go secure the hood. We ain't get shit together so some idiot can burn it down. Shit's real fucked up, man. Yeah, but we gonna handle this ourselves. Ain't no justice, man. How does scum like Tenpenny stay on the streets? Man, I don't know. Just the way shit's stacked, I guess. Man, this is fucked up. We should take that bastard down ourselves. And we will, sweet. So who's the weird Brit? What? Oh, Macker. He got a little problem he can't control. What kind of problem? He can't stop, you know, giving himself a little bit. What, you mean he likes to consult Professor Hans Jerkoff? <laughs> yeah, regularly. Spank the monkey? Yeah. Take Pomula out? Quit it. <laughs> Burp the worm? Enough, man. Shit, look at this place. Even old ladies robbing shit. I guess it's better than staying home and watching the shopping channel. Yeah, go out there and get yourself a bargain. Shit, man. People real mad. Ten penny responsible for all of this. As if the ghetto ain't wrecked enough. Come tomorrow, most perceptions gonna have new TVs. Look at them like angry kids and some shit. They just tearing up their own neighborhood. Nothing good is gonna come of it. Everything's burning! Put your foot down! Man, the ghetto's tearing itself apart. Carl. Give it up, shit. CJ, you asshole. Gather up some homies and get the hood locked down. You need anything, give me a call. I'm gonna check out the city and see what I can see. You be careful out there, CJ.
know you ain't got no dick, but maybe you got heart, homie. Bailey's for white, CJ. What's up? You two-bit backstabbing piece of eggplant shit! Salvatore! Nice to hear from you too! You're dead! Your friends are dead! Your family's dead! I'm gonna fuck you up and your children and your grandchildren! Well, it's been nice talking to you, but uh, I got some money that needs spending on some expensive trash. So if you excuse me... You're dead! Dead! <laughs> Is that you again? Hey, 